Well, cocktails, canines, and some good company. This sounds terrific. A new bar in Everett offers dog lovers and their companions a fun space. WBZ's Anna Myler shows us an indoor dog park with some very tasty drinks. Welcome to Park 9, a new spot in Everett where dog owners' dreams come true. We knew people were excited to be able to bring their dog places. We didn't realize just how excited they were. With Emily Gussie's business degree and Tess Kohansky's background in urban planning and commercial real estate, plus their love for their golden retriever, Nora, the newlyweds created this new concept, becoming the first dog park and bar in New England. Employees as well as people have come up to me and be like, I just am like standing around smiling, and then I realize I'm smiling, and then I'm like, well, why am I smiling? It's like, well, because there's so many dogs here, and they're so cute, and everyone's so happy. The couple spent two years transforming this former cement manufacturing facility into an oasis for people who hate to leave their best friend at home. There are indoor and outdoor play areas with park rangers keeping a close eye, separate spaces for large and small dogs, and two bars. That allowed people to come in, have a drink, and let their dog play off leash, but also enjoy the company of friends in a chill our environment, which is why we kind of have our bar and lounge side um, that is an on-leash space. Humans can choose from a list of beers from New England, cocktails with creative names like the Bob Barker and the Bark Side of the Moon, and a curated wine list. We have a really cool wine, wine selection where we're trying to focus on women-owned, minority-owned, sustainable and organic types of wine. And your four-legged friend can also fetch a treat from the bar. Of course, cookies. Um, we have dog beer. We have cookie flights. And they even have special pairings for you and your dog to share. Founders Manhattan, of course, paired with a dog cigar. During the day, Park 9 doubles as a doggy daycare. <laughs> and if you scratch beneath the surface, you'll find there's even more to this business. The pair has philanthropic goals, starting with their cocktail for a cause. Part of the proceeds go to dog-focused nonprofits. And their desire to be a good employer and member of the community. We care and value about our work-life balance. We care about the people that we're working with. Um, and so I really want, I'm really excited to see how we can be the, yeah, the best organization that we can be. Most of all, their goal is to be an inclusive, positive place for all people and their pups. I think very few places have I seen people happier than in here and that just is so yeah. that is so fulfilling for us i think you know seeing not only the smiles on the humans faces but the dogs faces as well and just that sense of community reporting from heaven on earth anna myler wbz news